docker hub or how to push the image directly uh, from my particular desktop docker to a docker hub fine uh, you can use uh, jenkins also to do this since we are already aware of jenkins and we are already aware of this pole sem or continuously running the program you can just integrate with that later on but now let us just uh, push the particular uh, program into a docker hub using command prompt in a very basic manner fine so we'll see how to do that so for that what i'm going to suggest you to do is that the first thing that we have to do is that we'll just go ahead with the command prompt first so since we have already opened up the docker hub and i have all so for the first thing that we are just going to do is one is open the docker hub with your email id and password then the docker desktop with your email id and password fine so after these two things i have to go ahead with the command prompt fine so after opening these two things what i'll do see these are the images that i have right so what i'll do here is that i'll just go ahead with the i'll just go ahead with the command prompt okay so let me type it command prompt so i just want to see you have to open the docker desktop and the docker hub as well fine with your email id and password docker i'll just search images you can just give docker login if you have not logged in so it gives me the set of repositories that i have in my docker desktop so let me show it to you yes so these are the repositories that i have mysql and test python test docker mysql my jenkins and docker so all these things are the repositories that i have fine see these are the repositories that i have see this you might have observed here divya cd891 new test so this is one of the new test is the one of the particular uh, image that i have uh, actually pushed into the docker hub fine so that is why it is showing my username along with the new image name uh, this is nothing but the image of test python itself fine so first you just give docker images okay you will just get the set of images then we have we have the syntax so after this what we should do is we have the syntax how to push this particular file into the docker hub so for that see the syntax is like this so you have to give a docker tag then you have to give your repository name here then you will be uh, i'll just uh, type here so you have to mention it as docker tag and then you can just give the repository name a repository name and then tag name tag name then docker hub name okay that is whatever the name that you have given for the docker hub docker hub name then that is followed by slash and that is followed by the display name whatever the name that you want to display now right so the display name. this is a syntax for it fine with by using the same syntax uh, repo name is nothing but see here you are able to see the repository so this is the name tag name see we have latest none and all these things right so whichever the uh, repository you are using the tag that is pertaining to that repository we have to give it here and then docker hub name so docker hub name is divya cd891 i have my docker hub name as divya cd891 you can give your docker hub name see here you will get it as it is divya cd891 so in the same way you will also be having your own docker hub name fine so that we have to give and then we can give the display name. display name is a new name that you are just going to give it to fine so now we'll just give the display name is yours that is a user name that you are just going to do that is whatever the name that you want for a particular application you can give that fine so now we'll just type that what is it docker tag docker tag then i'll just give it as repository name repository name uh, i'll just uh, take that as uh, uh, test python itself okay test python then what is that so this is the repo name i am typing then 
the tag name that is accompanied is latest. So this is the tag name that is accompanied with it. And then hub name. Hub name is nothing but Divya CD891. 891 is the hub name that I'm just going to give. Then slash display name for this test python is. I'll give it as test python1. Test python1. So this is the new name that I have provided. Fine. So it is showing docker uh, tag requires two arguments that we have to give. So for this how to go ahead tag repo name is test python then I can give it as tag name as latest then docker hub name then display name along with the tag name once again fine. Right? So the same thing I'm just going to give here. There we had given some given some spaces and we just missed this colon. So it was showing that it exactly requires two arguments there. Fine. So now if I do this, then I have to push this to Docker Hub, right? So Docker push command. Push command. What is my hub name is Divya CD891. Then the display name I should give it as uh, test python test python test one right test python test one okay was it three okay an image does not exist locally with the tag name the vi ninety one test python okay t a t I have given. So, I have to give it as T E S T. Okay, so now it is preparing your image and it will push your image that you have created into the Docker Hub. So, it is showing mounted onto that particular uh, hub. So, you can go there and you can just uh, check there. Okay. Fine. So now we'll just go and we'll just check that. Have we got that? See now. Previously I had only new test. Uh, less than a minute ago I just had test python test one. So this is how we will be pushing the particular image from the docker to a docker hub and you can use uh, Jenkins also to run this continuously the same thing whatever we did in Jenkins the same thing we can do here but with uh, separate build functions post build as uh, change changes there but for pushing this is enough as a basic requirement okay thank you